welcome back so in this video we are going to see the settings or options of uh, different apps and uh, if you're working with windows you know that settings are options there are a lot of things that we go in them to enable to enhance the functionality or get the functionality that we want now again we know that for the uh, different apps uh, there are usually settings inside over here that for the app itself oh it's in still in full mode but then there are preferences that are built for through the system so basically in uh, surprisingly uh, for the when you go through the uh, the menu bar for the settings or preferences it takes you to a chrome's default preferences i'm going to close it and see what happens with the safari uh, again all right so for safari let's see what we get general so safari has a lot of preferences this is more like internet uh, explorer had options that uh, we messed with for a very long time from windows xp to all the way to windows 7 probably yeah those were the good old dial-up days then we had to do a lot of tweaking for the internet connection uh, so let's go with the text editor right here you can see now I have preferences for the text editor and you can see which which want uh, the format the width height everything you can control from here so preferences is like options or settings in Windows and for the each uh, application just like that is basically universal for Mac you have to want to make sure that the app is active its name is there and then you click on that name then you can get to the preferences there might be some applications that may not have any preferences let's see what what uh, maps have so does map have any preferences yeah quite a few so some has more some has less so that is for the preferences all right so I, if this video has helped you, please rate, comment, subscribe and share and I will see you in the next one.